Facebook Live. Facebook Live, we have arrived. Let's get it in, y'all. I want to thank um, everybody for chiming in. This is Watchman uh, uh, Derek Israel, also known as Pastor Derek, on an early Will I Seek the Scripture Study and Prayer Line um, on this first day in um, July 2021. It appears that this isn't working. Oh, it is working. <laughs> I was wondering if it was working this morning, y'all, but I see that it is. Okay. I want to thank the Most High for um, uh, Yakuan being in attendance on this on this uh, morning, and James and Visha and the family is in attendance as well. Uh, we got. Uh, uh, Yosef in the building and uh, Battle is up in here once again with Big Sister Fee. Uh, we got Mother Joyce. Uh, hallelujah. We got uh, Colt Rita B and Johanna up in here on this morning. And, and as you come in, and feel free to push uh, the share button. Let's start off as soon as you come in. Those that are willing, please hit the share button. And those of you that are uh, a professional witnesses, don't mind. Not ashamed of the, of the best array of the gospel. Don't mind pushing uh, uh, the, 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 the uh, you know, ta tagging. That's what they call it, tagging, tagging, tag. Tagging folk. Um, it's a unique way of going witnessing. It's pretty easy. You don't have to put shoes on. You don't have to put shoes on your fingers. I think there's not too much pressure on your fingertips to push uh, the tag button several times uh, to invite your loved ones in. If you believe the word is true, then share it. Then share it. Then share it. Uh, uh, yes, 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 yes. Yeah, I think it's a good, good morning, family. Uh, uh, how we say that? Uh, 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 Boko Tov, Miss uh, Yeah, yeah. Kita, good to see you on uh, this morning. Yeah, good to, good to see you on. Y'all do your tag game now, or, or at least push the share button. Let's get ready to get in the word, y'all. Um, we're, we're, we're gonna go to several scriptures. We're painting word pictures, uh, uh, being led by the Ruach. Let, 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 let's go to Acts 1. Let's go to 1. I'm just, I'm just, let's dive into the meat of what we're talking about this morning. Look at what this say. Acts 1 and 8. Look what this says. It says, but ye shall receive power. Mm -hmm. After after that, the Ruach HaKadosh. Yeah. After the, the spirit of the Most High is come upon you. Right? And ye shall be witnesses unto me both in Jerusalem and Judea and Samaria unto the uttermost parts of the earth. Um, you, 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 you go, Jackie, good to see you on young lady, but you, you, you're going to receive something you didn't have before. You didn't have this before. Yeah, we was pretty equipped. He was good to us, but, but we had that sinful nature. So it was on, we was on autopilot to sin. We we're born in sin, shaped in iniquity. Folks got attitudes and all that. And then and then when, when the Most High chose his chosen people, that was a bloodline thing, honoring his 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 covenant agreement with, with Abraham. Yeah, that, that was a bloodline thing. But but they was pretty carnal now. He gave them the commandments on stone, but they was pretty carnal. So what we really needed was something we didn't have, and that was the literal spirit of our creator living inside of us. That's what we needed. So that's what he gave us. But you shall receive power. The power isn't, you know, 
we don't we want to get like too religious with it and all that getting it understanding. What did you get when you got him? What kind of power did you get? What kind, what kind of power did we receive that we did not have before? Right? Whatever this power is, it's going to enable you to become witnesses, which is way deeper than just going witnessing. Because you got a lot of people that's going witnessing, but they're not witnesses. There is a difference. And it's a big difference. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Whatever this power is, you, you, you're going to be a living witness. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Now, 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 Corinthians, again, gives you the glimpse of what all his spirit can do. JB, good to see you on uh, uh, this morning. Tim, 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 I don't know if you received the information, Tim, about what we're going to be at uh, Lake Timiskau, uh, Berkeley, on Saturday. Love for you and the family to come out and let all of the rest of our Alamedian crew know we're going to be out there having a good time. In him, you know, bring the family out because you're more than invited. But look what the words say, y'all. But ye shall receive the ability of without being religious, power. What kind of power? Well, Corinthians, Corinthians 12 tells you the abilities that Yah got inside of his spirit that he's going to distribute to the believer, to his children that's baptized into his body. Neil, good to see you on this morning. Yeah, I'll send you the information, sir. Tim, I'll send it to you. But you shall receive power. Listen, we need some power. Good to see you on, Latricia Johnson. You shall receive power. Right? Power. Yeah, yeah. And if we study scripture, we'll find out what that power is. And it's great that this power that we did not have before because of our fallen nature. Yeah, we were told to do some things. We, 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 were, we were fallen from, 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 from the essence of our creator's spirit. Don Deems, good to see you on. Look what it say, y'all. Well, let, let's start digging deeper then. Let's go, to, let's go to Galatians 5 and 22. Listen, Galatians, I hope y'all writing, writing. Mentally taking notes. Somebody can write. Somebody out there can write these scriptures down. Listen. Galatians 5 and 22. Look what this say. This says, But the fruit of the Spirit. Y'all know what fruit is here? You know what that is? Layman terms. Proof. Proof of the Spirit. Yeah. Mm -hmm. uh, thank you, uh, Johanna. There you go. You're on your job, young lady. But the fruit of the Spirit. The proof. The proof of having the Ruah, the power, the power of having Yah's spirit. If you knew what Yah is, then you would know what Yah's spirit is. If you have the revelation that Yah is that spirit and where the spirit of Yah is, there's liberty. If you knew that the most high was that spirit, you got to have that revelation or else your theological positioning would be a little weird. Not completely. A lot of people agree with you, but you don't have that level of understanding that you should. But listen, the fruit of having his spirit, a.k.a. proof of having the Ruah, proof of having the Father living inside of you. Mm -hmm. Listen, the fruit of the spirit is love. I heard the scripture say, Yah is love. Yeah, Yachanan is the one that, that helped us realize that, right? Listen, the proof of having the Ruah is love, joy, peace, long-suffering, gentleness, goodness, and faith. That's the proof of having the Ruah HaKadet. What did the Bible say the proof is? The fruit, the attributes, the lifestyle mm -hmm. of having of the Ruah. Yeah, is you walk in the spirit of love, not religion. 
Oh, if we really looked into Corinthians 11 and having his spirit comes with abilities to perpetrate love, to spread love, to nurture one another that's in the body. That's what 1 Corinthians uh, uh, 12 and 7 was telling you, that the abilities y'all give you is to, the, to nurture the whole body. Yeah, and Galatians 4 tell you, and he even gave titles and offices. Yeah, titles and offices for the perpetration of love. Yeah, you see somebody overtaking the fault, you with your spiritual. Listen, we go into restoration mode. Listen, the proof, the proof. Too many mean, wicked folk, lustful folk sitting around, you know, you know, with, with, yeah. <sighs> You, you you got you got you got you got you got folks do voodoo. They get to sounding weird and doing all kind of stuff, right? But the proof, the proof. Um, see, religious folks can't do that. Having a form of yawliness, denying the power thereof. What the world need is love. What the world need is yeah, not that perverted love. We ain't finna get crazy and and satanic. Satan always want to duplicate yah and bring that that per, that weird perversion in and want to call that love. No, give us ah, give me the rainbow back. That's not what that's for. Listen, the proof of the ruah, the proof. The proof of the Ruah is love, joy, peace, long-suffering, gentleness, goodness, and faith. All perversion, get out of here. I'm not, we're not going to play that. Don't have me tell you what agape really mean, and, and, and I, we ain't going there. The Greek love, you got to do some studying. You got to look beyond what they try to tell you on the surface. There's some weird stuff going on. In this Catholicism piece, but we're not talking about that right now. We're talking about the proof of having the most high in your life is love, joy, peace, long-suffering, gentle, gentleness, and goodness and faith, right? We go through a transformation process because before we did not have that. We did not have that. Listen, all right, let's break it down some more then. Let's go to Galatians 5. Look at this. I just want to show you. I want to show you something. I just want to show you. Listen, uh, Galatians 5 and 16. Uh, for, uh, I'm, 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 yeah, yeah, Galatians 5 and 16. Look what this say. I want y'all to get this. Look. This I say then, walk in the spirit, right? Walk in the spirit. Ain't number one spirit, y'all. But look. This I say then, walk in the Ruah. There ain't none but the spirit of Yah. Walk in it. If you knew... That, that the spirit of Yah is the word, <laughs> and the words that I speak unto you are ruah. The words that I speak unto you are spirit and life. How many spirits is it? Just one. Listen, this I say then, walk in the spirit. Walk in it. You can pray in it too. Yeah, according to his will. He said he'll do anything you ask according to his will. When, when, when you pray, yeah, sometimes we don't know his will like we should, but don't worry, the ruah got you. Listen. This I say then, walk in it though. Listen carefully. Walk in according to, the, walk in it. Yeah, you should be studying to show yourself approved on the yah, a workman that need not be ashamed, rightly dividing the word of truth. We're killing religion. Listen, this I say then, walk in it. In the spirit of love, in the spirit of yah. You should, you, you, you should be hiding the word in your heart that you might not sin against him. Yeah, you should be even, if you understood the shadow, the shadows and types, which were physical feast days and festivals and physical ways of, of worshiping the most high. The children of Israel had a whole nother platform, whole nother way of living uh, aside from what the world was doing. That was in idol worship and doing all kinds of stuff. He called them aside. He called them out and set them aside and gave them uh, uh, commandments on stone, uh, 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 rituals and feast days and new moons. He gave them wardrobes and he and they dressed different. They walked different. They talked different. It was all outward of physical things that had some spiritual connotations, but it wasn't the complete thing yet, yet, yet. Yet, right? But he's telling us right now, listen, to walk in the spirit. Walk in it. Walk according to the word. Yeah, the, the revealed word, right? Walk in it. And, and if you do, look what he said going to happen. 
you shall not fulfill the lust of the flesh. Oh, now here we go again. That the, the even all the way down to religion, having religion, religious folks is a little different than spiritual folk. Uh, hopefully, the word can give you revelation today. Listen, but if you walk in the spirit, walk in it. Walk. You shall not fulfill the lust of the flesh. We gotta understand that we have lust of our flesh. We have what they would call a, a human nature. That's the lust of the flesh. That's the desires of humanity. What well, the desires of humanity is changed since Adam switched his desires from Yah to his wife. Death came in because his desires switched from Yah to his wife. Had he kept his desires on Yah, he still would have been able to love his wife, but he would have loved his wife right it wouldn't have been a perverted love. It wouldn't have been the type of love that I got to leave y'all to love you. No, 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 no. If loving you is wrong, I do want to be right. So I ain't going to love you like that. Come on. Mm -hmm. I'm going against the songwriter because he was led by the flesh when he wrote that song. Listen, this I say then, walk in the spirit of the most high and you shall not, you, you ain't going to do it. You shall not fulfill the lust of the flesh. You're not going to do it. Look what else it says. Listen. And then the 17th verse says, For the flesh, our human nature, right, lusts against the ruah. Look, all the way down to there's a way to seem right unto a man, but the end thereof is the ways of death. I'm talking about even from an ideology standpoint, from a theological standpoint. There's a way to seem right to man, but the end of it is the ways of death, right? It causes us to see scripture differently. I'm, I'm, I'm just telling you. That's why you got to have an ear to hear what the Ruah is saying to the Ecclesia. Listen, for the flesh lusts against the spirit. Yeah, you know, the flesh want to cuss and lie and cheat, commit fornication and adultery, self-preservation will not humble itself to Yah. Yah will tell you what to do. And if that's a stronghold for you, you can end up in witchcraft because the stronghold will keep you instead of his Ruah, instead of his word. His word want to keep you and nothing else. So you need the word to break those strongholds because if, if the word don't break them, it ends up witchcraft for you. It ends up stubbornness. It ends up rebelliousness. Yeah. And stubbornness is as the sin of witchcraft. The word come and you just refuse to do what it say. The word not going to go away. It might go away in your heart because your conscience can get seared with a hot iron. And, and, and what the word is saying to you, you don't, you won't hear no more. You won't even be convicted no more. Cynthia, good to see you on, Miss Jones. Bless you. Big Sean, good to see you as well. Take care of mother, you hear me? All right, now. Look, for the flesh lusts against the spirit. Listen, the flesh, the evil nature that we have fights against the spirit of Yah, fights against the word. All the way down to remember of Paul. Paul fought against the word even though he thought he was worshiping Yah. He unintentionally was fighting against the word until the, uh, the, the spirit of uh, the Messiah knocked him off his donkey on the road to Damascus. And then there were scales on his eyes because he was religiously blinded. He was blinded by religion. And Ananias had to come down and lay hands on him. That the religion fell off, the religious scale fell off from him that he could see in the Ruah. Yeah. So the flesh... Lust, our human nature, lust against the spirit. But don't get it twisted. The spirit against the flesh too. Yah's against our flesh. That's why he give no glory to our flesh. That's why he give no glory, no credit to humanity because that species is fallen. Look what this species did to the earth. Of course, under the influence of the snake and his children, the snake people, people the Khazarians, the fake Jews that stole his true children's identity, that are in the earth tearing this place up, perverting everything, want to stick needles in your arm and, and, and pervert and switch and destroy, kill, still and destroy. Yeah, 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 yeah. But, 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 but Yah is against that spirit as well. Yah, Yah is fighting against the, the spirits of darkness. He going to win too. 
What he's doing is he's giving us the opportunity to walk in the Ruah and we'll position ourselves against uh, the, 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 the rulers of darkness of this world. We, 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 we'll, we'll understand the scriptures when they say obey the laws of the land. Uh, folks don't understand that. Folks think they're supposed to cooperate with, 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 with spiritual wickedness in high places. People really believe that stuff. So I'm going to keep teaching. I'm going to keep teaching. Don't worry. Listen, for the flesh, this human nature fights against the word. It's at war with the word. I'm telling you. It's like war of the roses. Our flesh fights against the world, but we can have a form of yalliness. Yeah, we can have a form of loving Yah, but denying the power thereof, which causes us to be religious, claiming him as we fight against him. Yeah, even from doctrinal positions, we're fighting against him, even when it's unbeknownst to ourselves. We be fighting against him and don't even know it. And that's big for religious people, but I'm going to keep teaching. For the flesh lusts against the spirit. Listen. And the spirit against the flesh. Listen what it say. These are contrary one to another. They don't get along, y'all. And how can two walk together except they be agreed? They're never going to agree. That's why the word told us to mortify the deeds of the flesh. We got to kill out our human nature. We got to be humble enough to be retaught. Reconsider truth as it is unfolding heavily in these last and evil days. No, it's time out for having a form of yalliness. Ain't no Merry Christmas here. I look at the origin of Christmas. Ain't no Happy Easter here. I look at the origin of Easter. I know the truth of it. No, I don't need no replicas of truth. I need the truth because the origin of their Easter, they're, 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 uh, yeah, yeah, is way different from what the children of Israel was doing and the Bible teaches. But listen, the flesh, the carnal nature, the wicked nature of people, man, right, fights against the word. Mm -hmm. But don't get it twisted. Yah is fighting against the flesh. Yeah, and he told you to kill your flesh so you can dwell in his presence, right? And these are contrary the one to another. So look what it say. You cannot do the things that you would. You can't do what you want to do. Yeah, you, you, you might want to do it. It might feel good. Yeah, yeah, but you're gonna end up dead. You're gonna end up, you gonna end up on the wrong end of this thing. And you don't want it. Because you can see the Satan and his children, if y'all really knew how much they conquered this place. Folks is lightweight stuck right now, whether they know it or not. You can pretend all fo folks is getting needles in them, didn't want it. They pretended like they wanted it. At first they were saying no until the pressure came. And then they want to pretend like they studied and now they're comfortable with it. You ain't comfortable with it. You don't know what they just did to you. Unfortunately, I know a lot of what they just did to you and it ain't good. But if you bow down to Yah, if you bow down to Yah and walk away from sin, he can deliver and help you. I'm going to teach the truth anyhow. I'm not trying to hurt nobody's feelings. I keep telling you, y'all love you, and the only thing that's going to set you free is truth. But I'm going to keep teaching y'all. Listen, for the flesh less against the spirit. Listen, and the spirit against the flesh. These are contrary. They don't get along one to another. So it ain't no, it ain't, it ain't no, uh, um, you comfortable in the flesh while you serving Yah. No, everybody that has suffered in the flesh has ceased from sin. Your flesh is suffering if you're not sinning. You ain't saying what you want to say and doing what you want to do. Beverly, good to see you on, young lady. Always a pleasure. Dave, my brother in here now. Y'all finna have a truck. Y'all finna have problems. problem. Listen, so that, that you cannot do. You can't do. I don't do what I want to do. Because what I want to do ain't right. What I want to say ain't right. No. I, so you cannot do what you want to do. Listen to the key. This is a kicker. We're going to go further now, y'all. We're shifting gears. But if you're led of the spirit, you're not under the law. Listen, but if you're led of the spirit, we need to rule. I remember you received after that, the, the Holy Ghost has come upon you. You shall receive power. Didn't it say it in the KJV? After that, the Holy Ghost has come upon you. It's the Ruah HaKadosh, y'all. Let me teach. After the, after, after the Holy Ghost has come upon you, right, you shall receive power. Listen, the power to, to not be under the law because, because, because because the spirit that that was what was on the stone <laughs> the spirit that was on the stone is now baptized inside of you and you're led by it you obey it 
which takes you from under the law. See, see, the law is that spirit on stone. Remove the stone, and then the, that spirit is baptized inside of you. So who the one that gave the commandments is living inside of you, leading and guiding you. It's way different. Me, me, me saying something and putting it in a letter, then the, my spirit being baptized inside of you, the one that, 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 that said the stuff, uh, the ingredients of the letter, that's a whole nother level. That's a whole nother level. So that now the Yah's in you. Do he have healing? Yep. Do he have discernment? Yeah, yeah, Yah got Yah, Yah have all knowledge. He have all wisdom. He can heal. Do he know all languages? Yep. Do he know all interpretation of languages? Yep. Do he have the gift of that? Yep. And the gift of this? Yep. And the other. This, that, and the other. Yah got it all, and now he's living inside of you, and he's giving you the abilities to walk in the Ruach so you can save folk through his spirit. It ain't you. It's his Ruah that's doing it. Yeah, 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 yeah. So now that I pray, when I pray, he said, if you ask anything according to my will, you'll have it. Sometimes we ask for stuff that ain't according to his will. So so we got to learn how to pray in the spirit. He said, you, he, said, he said, walk in the spirit, right? He said, walk in the spirit. He said, live in the spirit. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We got to pray in the spirit. We got to walk in the spirit. We got to move in the spirit. Oh, I'm trying to tell you something if you get it. Listen, so now let's go deeper. Because now we know that if, 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 if we're led of the spirit, we're not under the law. If we're led, of the, if you if you're not led of the spirit, you definitely under the law because the law was made for you. And I'm gonna show you first. First Timothy, listen, listen. I hope y'all writing it down. First Timothy one five. Oh, we're gonna get the devil today. Yesterday too, though. Listen. First First Timothy one and five. Look what it says. It says now the end of the commandment. What you mean the end of the commandment? I'll teach that another time. Precisely. I'm teaching it now, but precise, sir. Precise, sir. Listen. Now the end of the commandment is the end of the commandment. Woo! The end of the commandment is charity. The end of the commandment, didn't it say if we we're led of the spirit, we're not under the law? That ended the law for you. Listen. Now the end of the commandment is charity. Y'all is charity. Charity is love. Y'all love in action. Yeah. Now, the end of the commandment is charity out of a pure heart. So you end the commandment when you receive the word of the most high and it's baptized inside of you. That ends, that ends the commandment for you. Yeah. Now, the end of the commandment is charity out of a pure heart and of a good conscience and of faith unfeigned. Right? Pure faith. It's not, it's not. Tarnished. Oh, I trust Yah. It's ugly as heck out here. Yea, though we walk through the valley of the shadow of death. I'm not scared. Why? Faith unfeigned. I'm rolling with him. I'm ro I'm rolling with the most high. I'm trusting him. He knew all this stuff before I was born. I was born here. What I don't know, I don't need to know. And what I need to know, he will show. And he going to lead and guide me through this valley. Yeah, I ain't worried about it. It's ugly as heck. What this mean? What this mean? I don't know, but y'all know. But he told me to go. <laughs> so I'm gone, baby. I'll see you when I get there. Listen. For, for which some has swerved, right? Some, some folks be swerving. From which some have swerved, having turned aside onto vain jangling. You know, folks, we want to get hotep and Muhammad and them and want to talk. Oh, I ain't got time for it. I don't, I don't, I got to stay focused so I won't go for the hocus pocus. Listen, seven first then says, desiring to be teachers of the law. Okay, you got some deep folks. Oh, they got the outfit too. What color they got on? Are they wearing purple and gold? Listen, desiring to be teachers of the law, right? Desiring to be teachers of the law, understanding neither what they say nor whereof they affirm. Affirm, you know how people say, amen, or amen, or oh, I agree, so be it, salah, you know, them folk, right? Desire to be teachers of the law, understanding neither what they say nor whereof they affirm. Oh, that's right, that's right, that's what they say, ain't it? Shemaine Yahoo, good to see you on. Look, 
But we know that, but we know that the law is good. The law is good. Ain't nothing wrong. It's the word of Yah. How could it not be good? Who spoke it? Yah. Who gave it? Yah. How could it not be good? It is great. Y'all remember that? Don't go get no cereal yet. Listen. For we know that the law is good. If a man use it lawfully, then it ain't so good. When it's out of place, when you don't understand his grace, then it's not so good. Oh, listen to me. I'm going to show you something. Ninth verse then says, knowing this, you got to know that the law is not made for a righteous man. The law is not made for a righteous man. Who is righteous? Yeah. What causes a person to be righteous is one is led of his spirit. Mark Logan, talk to me. Knowing this, that the law is not made for a righteous man. The law is not made for a righteous man. Who is righteous? Those that are led of his spirit. Those that tell themselves no, and they do what y'all say. Period. I'm just going to do what y'all say. Those that have faith in y'all. It's not my goodness. I can't take credit for me not cussing you out. I'd have socked you in the mouth while I was cussing. But because of his ruah, I, 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 I'm, I'm led of his spirit, so I'm not under the law. Laws is for the lawless. Laws are for lawless. Laws are for the lawless. You don't have to tell, you don't have to give me a law on pee in my living room. I'm not going to pee in your living room. But if somebody come and pee in the living room, then the laws for them. Joker, you better not pee in my living room. That's what the bathroom is for, you nasty. Okay. Knowing this, you got to know something, right? Are you listening? Knowing this, that the law is not made for a righteous man, but for the lawless and for the disobedient. How many of y'all lawless? Then the law is for you. How many of y'all disobedient? Then the law is for you. But if, you, if you're led of the Ruah, if you're led of the Ruah HaKadah, if you're filled with the Ruah HaKadah, how in the world is the law for you? You're righteous. You obey Yah. You're not committing adultery. You're not committing fornication. You're not running around here killing people. You're not running around here sowing discord. Come on. You're walking in the spirit of truth, the spirit of love. Yeah, you're a new creation because if any man being a Messiah, he's a new creation. All things have passed away. Behold, all things have become new. Knowing this, you got to know this, right? You got to know this, man. Knowing this, that the law is not made for a righteous man, but for the lawless, for the disobedient, for the unyali, for the sinners. There goes sinners saved by grace. Grace ain't for you, sinner. Grace is for those that walk away from sin. Because grace is the ability to walk away from sin. Knowing this, that the law is not made for a righteous man, but for the lawless and for the disobedient, for the unyali and for the sinners, for the unholy, for the profane, for the murderers' fathers and the murders of mothers, for manslayers, for whoremongers, for those that devour themselves with mankind homosexuality. I didn't say it. The word did. For whoremongers, for them that defile themselves with mankind, for men stealers, for liars, for perjure persons, and if there be anything contrary to sound doctrine, anything contrary to the word of Yah, that's who the law is for. But when we get filled with the spirit, y'all, <laughs> when we get filled with the spirit, We above the law. When we get filled with the spirit. Renee, I ain't seen you in so long. Call me. I'm going to call you. When we get filled with the Ruach. We above the law. Because that's better than rituals and all kind of ceremonial things. You got the conclusion of the matter living inside of you. When full circle came, when full circle came, he took us all the way through all the dispensations of time to end up with the most high living inside of us. What could be more powerful than that? Let's pray. Spirit of the most high, we love you and thank you for this opportunity to come before you humble as we know how. Gleaning in the truth of your word and your presence. Transform us by the renewing of our mind. Cause us to uh, uh, leave and cleave. Leave, leave, leave the world and that wickedness. Leave religion. 
and that wickedness, having a form of Yali is denying the power thereof, and give us the truth that we may be your sons and daughters of being used mightily by the power of your Ruah in these last and evil days. We celebrate the victory in you. Now use us. Baptize us all over again, again and again, and use us in these last and evil days. In the matchless name, Yahushua, we humbly pray. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. And I'm out. That was the lesson for this morning. Uh, we pray. Uh, you got it, Renee. It's good, fam. Uh, 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 we, we celebrate the most high. Um, even, 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 even for this, for that. Um, yeah. If, if you're blessed by the lesson, feel free to push the share button. Folks need to hear this. Yeah. <clears throat> Tim, I'm going to get you the information. Renee, I'm going to get you the information as well. We celebrating together over here in, in, uh, in North Oakland on Saturday, July 3rd. My big bro just came in. Good to see you, Rodney. Always a pleasure, a family member. Uh, uh, help me blast it out, uh, Beverly. We need to get these T-shirts off. Uh, s uh, spread the word on these T-shirts. I want to feed everybody. I want to get in the word with y'all and have a good time. Be somebody and some dominoes. Dominoes ain't a sin, y'all. <laughs> All right, y'all push the share button. I want to thank everybody that supports this ministry. We like to get out there with the people and do stuff. We like to feed and clothe and house. We try to do everything we possibly can. Whatever the Most High give us to do, we want to do it. <clears throat> and so those of you that support this ministry, you help me do it straight up. You help me. I'm able to study, spend time with y'all, get revelations, get further in truth. And you help me do it. May the Most High continue to bless you. Those of you that are blessed by this ministry. You're blessed by this ministry and would like to become a supporter of this ministry. It's my job to tell you how. Just go to a, a, a cash app. Put in dollar sign, donate to Derek. That's dollar sign, donate, the number two, D-E-R-R-I-C-K. Uh, yeah. We also got PayPal. You can go to paypal.me forward slash Derek Israel, D-E-R-R-I-C-K-Y-I-S-R-A-E-L. Or you can go inside of Facebook, inside of Messenger, and there's a giving button inside of there. Y'all 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 get these t shirts and let's go have a, a good time um um Saturday. Is that all right? Y'all contact me and get a t shirt. Is that okay? Um we we we're about to go on the conference line. Y'all wanna talk about this lesson? Feel free to. All you gotta do is dial through three oh two two oh two eleven oh two extension eight one five six four eight. Again three oh two two oh two eleven oh two extension eight one five six four eight. Is that good? Yeah, I'll call you, Renee. Y'all be brutal and broken shalom, I'm gone.